keeping up with the Kardashians' photoshoot fails as Chloe's team scrambled to scrub that unedited snap from the internet. Daily Mail looks back at the famous family's biggest photo fails. Hi, welcome to the Dumb Dumb News Channel. Thanks for watching. If you're new to the channel, consider liking, sharing, subscribing, and leaving your comments below. So I wanted to go over the five top things that you should consider before you compare your looks to others on social media. Before I do that, I'm just gonna cover the rest of this article. It says, the Kardashian clan have come under fire again for editing their pictures after an untouched image of Khloe Kardashian was accidentally released into the public domain over the weekend. While most would be proud to look so good in a bikini, it's not hard to see that the mother of one looked different to her high glamorized Instagram images that she shares with fans. Although the unedited snap has been praised by fans who were still in awe of the reality star's enviable curves and natural good looks, Chloe's team have been working hard to remove all traces of unauthorized photo. First thing that I want everyone to realize is research has shown that constantly comparing yourself and constantly seeking validation on your own images will make you feel depressed, jealous, and envious. So there's no need to do that. You should just be happy with yourself. Number two, too much of these images will make you believe these body types are what people want or should have. When in fact, just living a healthy lifestyle will make others proud of who you are. Number three, not knowing these images are edited or even fake might lead you to believe that these body types are possible, which can make yourself be harder on yourself, especially when you go on these crazy diets or exercise routines. Number four, we have all heard or seen some strange case of someone spending tons of money and time on unneeded surgery, sometimes to even look like their favorite celebrity. Number five, these people are supposed to be SJW or social justice warriors, and they just want you to subscribe to what they say, but you have to look at their actions. They still want you to buy their products and click on their images. And lastly, sometimes these changes in images just display to the entire world that there might be some underlying mental issues happening in your head. And let's read from this one article that I found here. People are comparing their appearance to people in Instagram images or whatever platform they're on, and they often judge themselves to be worse off. So that's one of the things that happens. Also, it says, there's this roller coaster of feeling anxious and then getting reassurance from other people that you look good, says Bills, but that probably doesn't last forever. And then you take another selfie. Lastly, take a break and engage in other activities that have nothing to do with your appearance and comparing yourself to other people, she says. Well, guys, there's a link to the entire article down below. I want to know what you guys think about all these social media influencers and Instagram models and these pictures that are clearly edited and sometimes fake. Leave it in the comments below. For the Dum Dum News channel, I'm Dum Dum.